what's going on YouTube this is your backyard gardener and I'm coming to you with a uh, video I am sitting up under my tent because it's extremely hot but this is my raised bed that I normally grow my sugar baby watermelons in here and this bed is no more than uh one and a half foot by maybe two and a half foot uh, and I normally put four plants this time I'm gonna put five because I germinated some extra seeds and I might might put five in there and, and grow one out of the container but this is all I use blood meal and bone meal I take about three handfuls I put it in the soil, sprinkle it in the soil, take another three handfuls of the other one, I sprinkle it in the soil, I mix it up real good before I plant my plants, then I put my plants in, and after that, about a week, I'll start feeding it fish fertilizer or fish and seaweed fertilizer, which is a liquid um, feed. And that's all I do throughout the whole season. Once I put the blood meal and bone meal in, throughout the season, I'll just water it in maybe twice a week or when needed with fish and seaweed fertilizer or fish fertilizer, whichever one you can get access to. So I'm going to put these in. I'm going to come back and I'm going to show you how they're set up. And that's going to be the end of this bed for growing sugar baby watermelons. So, this is what we have. One, two, three, four, five plants. And that's it. Blood meal and bone meal. It's your backyard gardener. Happy gardening, everybody.